Okay, y'all. So the, the title of her video is called Pouring Back Into Me, Self-Care, Co-Parenting, Swap Day, Making Teacher Give Bags. First of all, y'all, she got the um, picture up there for real. Like everybody's sweet. I gave everybody their bath and <sighs> your girl is extremely tired. I'm extremely tired. I need to get something for my back, y'all, too. When I be giving them a bath, because my back be hurting, but that's neither here nor there. Um, but I'm ready to fold clothes. I got some laundry that needs to be folded. And I don't. This particular video, she talks about this and she shows herself sleeping in the recliner. Um, I'm going to try to put a picture of the. the she, they have two chairs. That's kind of fishy to me in the house. And she did never show her bedroom off. Now, she did show Ma, Maverick's little corner off. I'm going to get back on that subject in a minute. But it's just kind of strange that you did not show the bedroom area off. I wonder why. And then, like I said, in this particular video, she just showed herself sleeping in that chair. Why would you sleep in that chair? Okay, there is two chairs. I don't know why. And I know one of these chairs she did a, they gave it to her in a sponsorship or something like that, or, you know, sent it to her for free. The sofa don't match that area. It don't go with the walls. It don't go with the family. And it's just ugly. It's too low. It's just not, it don't even go with the front, the rest of that furniture. Maybe that she'll work that out. Hopefully she does. Cause that's just just that's just mismatch and it's ugly to me. Um. Good morning, y'all. It is currently five thirty-three in the morning, um, and I am getting ready to get the four boys ready so they can go with their dad this morning. Um, right. That's the thing that don't make sense to me, y'all. Now again, she showed the downstairs area off. She didn't never show the upstairs area off with um her bedroom and like that which that's personal but it's still like you're doing all of that it, i don't know and my thing is why does justin have to come and pick them up in the morning i'm ready to do our co-parenting swap so get ready to do that y'all i'm so tired and after i get them ready they'll be heading out it's like she's trying to show everybody that they're doing this and I'm not understand. I still will never understand why. Wouldn't it make more sense for him to get them at night? And if he can't come in at a decent time or if he's doing something or busy, um, he still should be able to come and get them at a decent time in the morning before you leave the house or whatever you're planning on doing that day. Why can't he come then? Why get those kids up that early? They're not going to school. And if you're going to get them up that early and you're supposedly paying a nanny, which is, is to me is a babysitter. You're supposed to paying a babysitter. And this is allegedly playing a, paying a babysitter. Why can't you just take that money and put them in daycare? I don't know. I don't know. At least the first uh, five children, the two sets of twins and Miles, they can go to, if since you didn't want to put the, um, the second set of twins in preschool for whatever reason, that, that's actually free, costs nothing to you. Since you didn't want to sign them up for preschool, why didn't you, um, why don't you put them in daycare? I mean, the door and it'll be, be time to get and see how he's at the door talking like she don't let him in the house. It's weird. Why can't he come in the house? What he's been in the house with the, the uh with the birthday thing. He's been in the house um snapping pictures. He's been in the house doing homework with Marcel. It's like, why didn't he come in the house? Like it's like she always contradicts herself. Like it's like, oh, I'm not talking and we don't speak. And then we're speaking, we're hanging out, we do things together. It's just like, okay, which one is it? And why are you showing this? Are you showing this to the people that believe your lies? Because it is a lie. Because it ain't for people like me. It's just not like no. <laughs> Justin, Marcel, time for school. See, and in this part right here, the kids are in the same bedroom. So they, I guess the second set sleep in the same bed on the bottom and the first set sleep in the same bed. And I don't guess that they are in the same bed. So if you watch the video, you know what I'm talking about. So maybe it's a two bedroom house. And maybe my, I'm guessing Miles' bed is in there somewhere. So eventually they're gonna have to move out of that. I don't know, y'all. So they don't want to spend enough. They don't want to spend money on a bigger car. They don't want to spend money on even a bigger house. This is this house is significantly more smaller than the other one because they're sharing a room. Oh, sharing beds actually, and that's crazy to me. See, this is what I'm talking about when people make have these children. They can't afford them. Like you really just can't afford them. Seriously, like you just you can't do it. Also, guys, I'm not even going to put um, a picture of that, but that pantry was bare. It was not enough snacks and food or just even like um, 
what do you call that? Side dishes and condiments and all those things to go with making meals because fuck the snacks it just wasn't enough food in there to like for you to be preparing meals for your house where is that at I, you know like come on now this is a house of how many of them is it so she got six kids and it's her and justin so that's like uh -uh, it's too many people for, to not have that you know food up in there she also contradicts herself. She said that she goes out the mouth. Like, which one is it? Like, and you don't have to lie though. And is it, is it, and no, because it, it just don't make sense. Because whoever, who's ever at the house with the kids, they can get them off the bus. So that still contradicts what she said. Y'all get what I'm saying? It's just too much. You're like, I don't know. And then on top of that, she don't have to even talk about this, but she chooses to talk about it for whatever reason, because she wants people to know this stuff. She wants people to believe what she's saying for whatever reason. I don't know why. So, but it just don't add up. It still don't add up. I used to just sitting in this house by myself without the kiddos. Let's do it. So she's saying she's still getting used to that. But Mahogany, you Ben said that you and Justin were co-parented. So that don't make sense. So you're just getting time to yourself. Where is he taking him? Is it the fact that you're getting used to it because Justin and Marcel is in school now or what? But that's still only two children out of the six. Y'all make it make sense. For real. Like, because it just don't. And then on top of that, you go everywhere else without those children. So... Well, now this is the part that kind of baffles me. Now, if you see right here, she has a basket, like a basket where you keep your stuff, but it's another basket right here in this corner with Gillette male razors in there. And there's another thing of degree deodorant. But my thing is also, why would you have two baskets there on the side with two men's deodorant in there? I'm just saying, don't add it, don't make sense. Now, the one over here is. I, I don't know. It's just two sticks of the odor and two baskets. Why? And you have two. Are you using both men and their men's deodorant? Is what it is. Let me see if I can zoom in. And let me zoom in. But you guys can see that. There's a stick of the male's degree, and there's a stick of male's degree right here with uh and underneath this deodorant right here. You can see the Gillette razors, the men's Gillette razors. So I can. OK, so you can't use men's deodorant and use male razors, too. Like, I mean, you can, but this is a red flag. You know, don't make sense. OK, so she's sitting here eating. I don't know where the rest of the kids are. She said that they were Justin, but these are different days. It's not the same day that they are supposed to be with Justin. And the thing about that is if there was Justin, why does he come over there and put them on the bus? So who's going to, it just don't make sense. How can he come over there and pick them up? And then, so how are they going to get to school tomorrow? Are he going to drop them off? It, it just don't add up. It don't add up. Um, mm, Must be nice. And she need to get rid of those little tables. But the, the whole house just don't look good. You know, the decor is all over the place. I don't know what the aesthetic is in there. And it just don't, it don't match the place at all. Whatever. It just, you know, and she was talking about getting, she got some uh, gifts for the teachers. The kids just started school, by the way. And if you guys watch this video, you have to go back and watch the video. Because I'm not going to put that pantry up there. Y'all just could take my word for it. Right now, since the kids are just in school, you didn't need to focus on gift bags right now. You need to put stock your uh, pantry up with food for the kids. That's what you need to do. That's what you need to focus on. Make sure your your house is fully stacked with food for your kids because it is not. It's not. And, and if you can get to that point where you can do that type of stuff for other people, then do it. But right now, looking at your pantry and stuff, you can't do that. Your priorities are messed up. Even here, she's holding some new AirPods. Your priorities are messed up. Stock your pantry and stuff. And the little stars on the face, which they have different shapes, mahogany. Those are been out, have been out. Why do you want something you see somebody else with? Do, did you need those? Or did you want it? Like, want it because you saw somebody else with them? 
and heads of the best ones that I've got a purchase are at Marshall's, TJ Maxx. So go over there and look, look for them because that there, it ain't sticking there. It looks like a sticker. And those ones that truly work don't look like that. It would have uh, been sticking to your face. Oh, so, girl. So here she is. She's eating. She's doing it. This is, these are different days now, y'all. Um, I did hear her mention that the kids were with the nanny and blah, blah, blah. Ain't no nanny because they're babysitter, the care.com, whatever, whatever you want to call it, maybe. So, but I highly doubt that um, these people like to show off everything. And it's just not adding up to me that she's showing herself at the um, uh, the personal care, you know, the esthetician. So she's doing all of this stuff, y'all. Again, stock your pantry. And we don't need to. She's trying to be like them girls that's single. Those girls are single. And on top of that, the ones that are moms and you see them doing this, they got they can do that. Their kids are taken care of. Their kids ain't here there and everywhere else. They're not getting up four or five o'clock in the morning to ride out or to get up for some um, stunt for the, the social media or whatever. This don't need to be done and seen. If you're going to focus on yourself and yourself only, just keep yourself. If that's going to be the aesthetic of this channel, then just do that. Focus on the things that you do. You don't have to incorporate the kids. When you do talk about the kids, speak on the kids, it could be the kids are fine. They are doing good. They are thriving. Boom. That's it. Why is that over here on this channel? This should be up to the one because they upload when they want to upload it over there at the other one. I just can't. Okay, y'all. She talked a whole, a, a whole lot of stuff about a whole for herself, which Mahogany, we know that you take time for yourself. We see that all the time. Okay, so that's not lost on us. Um, again, so... She never specified how many bedrooms were in the place. But I'm guessing that it's a two bedroom because the baby's still in the room with her and all of the boys are in one room. So and it may be a three bedroom, but no bigger than that. OK, so. I'm just not understanding why Justin is coming to get those kids early in the morning like that. That's not realistic. I don't believe that for one second. Um, and then on top of that, he can come and get the, the little boys at night if this is real, um, which I don't think it is. It's not realistic. He hangs out your house, hangs out at your house all the time. They don't work anywhere, y'all. They don't have to clock in anywhere, her or him. So all this stuff about running around and getting a nanny, getting a babysitter for what? Why? Why do you need to do all, all of that? Nothing requires you to leave your house. You can start your camera wherever you are. So it's just don't make sense and it's not realistic for true parents like people that really are parents are really truly busy people if you say you're doing this doing that where is the product you're producing this and that blah 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 where is it and then on top of that people are not going to keep putting money out and they're not getting anything back like why do you keep investing in all these things these imaginary things where's the profit from this other than that, you're just a fool. You're running around spending money. You're running around making it seem like you got this and you got that. But the, the way you can do that, and this is my, this is not opinion. This is a fact. Stack your, stock your fucking pantry up or don't show it off. And even if we cannot see that, still, stock your refrigerator, stock your pantry. If it was just you, okay, whatever. Even if you just had one, ch one child there, okay, I could be like, okay, that's not much because it's just them two or whatever. It's just her and a baby or her and, you know, she just got her in a small four-year, four, year, four five-year-old, so they don't need that much food. No, girl, you got six kids and you and your man. So whatever. That's a lot. That is a lot. Y'all just don't add up the stuff in the bathroom. Why is men's degree in the bathroom? Now, I think I did see this is why I'm not really hanging on that too much because um, in their older, like the older, older videos, she was using men's degree. So I did see her use men's degree. So maybe she need men's degree, but I don't see why she would need two in like two little baskets with personal stuff in there with that in there. It just don't make sense to me. It ain't adding up. It don't never add up. And male razors, men's razors. I don't. Why would you need men's razors? So I don't know, but she tried to keep that little basket off to the side. Um, it's just too much, y'all. Having them, like I said, having them kids get up and do that and get up in the early in the morning—that's just that—that that is just horrible. 
that is just like, why? Why can't they get their rest? Why can't they get their sleep? Why are they getting up that early like that? And where are y'all going? Where are you going? What you got to do that you got to require those kids to get up and get out of their beds like that? Because if this man truly had a house, like I said, he would have got them kids that night before. That way you won't have to get up and do none of that stuff. You got to do none of that. And if you wanted to, he could he could take could have taken um, the other boys, and you could have put Justin and whatever his name, Marcel, could have stayed. Or you put them on the bus in the morning, you could have went about your day, slept in, or did whatever. And uh, because the other kids had already been gotten and taken care of the night before, like it just don't make sense, y'all. I don't, I don't get it. Uh, uh, you know, make me understand what's going on because I don't get it. It don't add up. It just don't. They don't. So I don't know. I don't know. Put y'all comments down below. But it does got that little house she's living in. There she's struggling. The furniture don't match all that stuff. It's just mismatched furniture. And like, you know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> I really don't like it. Um, and it's not for me to like. I know y'all. It's just my opinion. It's just. I don't know, I don't know, picnic tables. It's just, it just don't go. It don't go together. Like, no. Um, it don't go with the house. And until next time, y'all. <laughs>